Hi, my name is David. Today we're going to do number 226, invert binary tree. This is an easy level problem on LeetCode and we're going to solve it in JavaScript. So we're giving the root of a binary tree, invert the tree, and return its root. So we can see here we have a binary tree, starts off at 4, 2, 7, 1, 3, 6, 9. And we can see that the left side gets swapped with the right side. And then we dig deeper again, the 1 and the 3 get swapped, the left and right get swapped here. So this example two has a better look at it and we can solve this problem recursively and we can use this as an example, example of our base case. So with trees, the first thing you wanna do is return null if there's null so we can go up the call stack. Next we wanna happens, what, what do we wanna do if it's not null is that we wanna swap the left side. So looking at the three, the two here is the val one is the left and three is the right. So we can swap this dot left equal this dot right and so forth. And we keep calling that recursively up the call stack until we get to the root of it. So with the pseudocode, first thing we wanna do is that return if root is null, return null. Next thing we wanna do is that we wanna make the swap. But to swap it, we need to create a temp variable. So we have a, this dot left. We're gonna create a variable and assign it to that. And then we can next change that left side variable to the right side variable, and then change the right side variable to the swap. So create temp variable and assign it to this dot. So in this case, it'll be root dot left. Next, we now that we create a temp variable for the left side, we can change it. So change root dot left to equal root dot right. And now we can make the last change for this is that change root dot right to equal the temp variable. Great, so after this, now we have to keep calling this until we hit null. So we call the name, the name of this function invert tree to do the root dot left. And then we do the same thing to the right side. Great, so to put this in code, we just if root is equal to null, return null. Now we have to make the swap. So let temp equals root dot left, root dot left. Since we create a variable for it now, we can change it, root dot right, root dot right. We can set it equal to the temp. And then we just call it recursively invert tree root dot left invert tree root dot right and once we do that we just return the entire root because it's been inverted Great. Great. So let's talk about the time and space complexity. So time complexity is gonna be O of N since basically we're gonna look through each one of the, the nodes and then the space complexity is also gonna be O of N since we're creating a call stack. So every time we create a new function to call it recursively, that adds space. And N is the number of nodes inside of the head, inside of the, the binary tree we're giving. And that's all for this one. Thank you so much.